So in this video, we're going to demonstrate a technique or a test called the Babinski's reflex test. So a positive finding on the Babinski's reflex test, which is for a possible upper motor neuron lesions such as tumors and or ALS, just to mention two out of lots of different types of central nervous system problems that could be found positive with this test. So what we're looking for on this test for a positive finding would be a dorsiflexion of the big toe and a splaying of the other four digits. Normally what you would find with an adult over the age of two would be a scrunching of the toes or a flexion of all the toes or possibly no reflex at all. So to complete the Babinski's test, we use a slightly sharpened, sharpened object, but not sharp enough to actually cut the patient. And what we do is we start with the scratch test running from the heel to the pinky toe and then quickly across towards the pad or the base of the big toe. So we need to do this in a brisk fashion to try and induce a genuine reflex. So what we do is from the heel to the pinky toe and across. And what we're looking for is either no reflex or a flexion reflex with the feet. This would be a negative or a downturn, which is a normal reflex for an adult over the age of two. If we had a positive finding on the reflex as we drew up and across, what we would find is a dorsiflexion of the big toe and a splaying of the other four toes. This would be a positive finding or what's known as an upturn and this would be an indication of an upper motor neuron lesion.